right now we're in the Hollywood Mall at Hollywood and Highland. So it's like the most crazy part of LA is Hollywood and Highland. Just total craziness. Uh, we used to live here and um, if I can find those videos I'll, I'll put them up and, and you can see just how crazy it is. Uh, just look at the link below or here. And, uh, but right now we want to get some coffee. So this is the, the mall and they reenacted this set from some old movie. I think it was Ben Hur. I'm not sure. And they read, they modeled the mall after these Babylonian. Uh, it was like a movie about, um, like a gladiator, a slave or a gladiator, or something and something. It was one of the first epic uh, Hollywood movies. Hollywood and Highland Mall. They have all these sayings on the sidewalk like like that. Those are all backwards. Anyway, there's these statues. It's kind of a boring place, honestly. It's just a bunch of tourists. Hats shopping, spend a lot of money, superficiality, I mean, I, I don't know. But then down on the street, so down on the street is Hollywood Boulevard and they have a lot of uh, movie premieres and stuff like that. Like we saw the premiere for Star Wars and if you want to come and actually see the actors, you can. if you come early enough, it's pretty easy to get on the red carpet and see the actors go by. Um, you just need to find out what movie is premiering, and then you can see it. It wasn't that difficult. It's so funny because they do this thing where they act like they don't want you there, like it's VIP only, but then like they need a crowd there for them to feel important, so they want you there, but they don't want you there. It's kind of weird, but anyway. But the real craziness is here on Hollywood Boulevard. Like this place is just insane, man. So they obviously had some kind of premiere here today. That's why there's so many people here. And it looks like they have the streets blocked off. So that's what they do. They block off Hollywood Boulevard for the, you know, when they're having a premiere. So there are all these like, people in costumes. Like they're, they'll get mad at you if you film them. Like that guy, that Bumblebee guy, like if I film he's gonna get mad at me. Because uh, they want money. They're like these Hollywood hipsters and they this is how they make money. Um, oh, maybe it's the premiere of The Lion King. That's probably what it is. Yeah, that's what it is. The new live action Lion King. You like that guy? He's doing Superman. If I take his picture, he's going to get mad at me. Watch. No photography. Anyway, this is what it's like. It's just crowded. People selling hot dogs. And other vendors. Oh yeah, this is a red carpet. What does it say? Quentin Tarantino. The ninth film from Quentin Tarantino. Oh, maybe there was a film festival here. I don't know what... So they have a lot of premieres down there too. Like red carpet coming down this way. So, it's a hot dog lady. <laughs> Another hot dog lady. So there's a lot of people selling like art and doing, it's like a carnival really, Hollywood Boulevard. It's basically a carnival atmosphere, really. The Hard Rock Cafe. The TLC Chinese Theater. It used to be the Man Chinese Theater. 
and then I guess this company too, TCL bought it and it's now the TCL Chinese Theater. Hey, it's Robin Williams star, what do you know? <laughs> so this is the Star Walk of Fame also. So yeah, they were having something here, but it's over obviously. When the, when the new Star Wars came out, they had a tent, a white tent that was all the way from there, all the way down there. For VIPs only, of course. More hot dogs. <laughs> the ice cream man. Yeah, I'm walking on the wrong side of the road. It's just so crowded. I hate coming down here. It's way too crowded, and like there's guys hawking every freaking thing from you know their rap CD to like all kinds of stuff. Anyway, so this is excuse me, the Man Chinese Theater or TCL now Chinese Theater. And they're always having events here and stuff. I've never actually been in here. See, there's Zoro. Black Zorro. What was the event here today? Oh, it's tomorrow. What is it? What is that? Is that a movie or something? It's gonna be about like old Oh. Oh, I see. So it's like an event. It's a tomorrow. Oh, there's a movie. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> Some shows like extra, yeah. Like the red carpet and all that. Yeah. Oh, okay. And so the movie. <laughs> and what's the movie? Okay. Time, oh, okay. I have it's, to look at. It's about old time Hollywood, and I think they're even supposed to talk about Charles Manson. I see. It's like a documentary. Yeah. No, it's a movie. It's a movie like reenacting stuff. Yeah, yeah. I see. Uh -huh. Cool. All right. Thank you. Okay. Well, there you have it. That's what's happening tomorrow. And that's about as exciting as it gets. <laughs> hey, there's Black Panther. I knew he's trying to go incognito. He's been shopping. Lots of scooters, lots of scooters. So you definitely won't be hungry, <laughs> but you will be crowded for sure. It's crowded, crowded, and don't come at night. It's like even worse. It's creepy and and crowded and just it's just crazy. It's like a carnival at night. <laughs> picture with Superman. Look, my wife's gonna, she's a conspiracy theorist, so she's gonna freak out when she oh, sees yeah, Freemason. Yeah. Did she see that already? Oh yeah. It's just a, a club for, it's called the Masons. There was the people who built like bricklayers and stuff. Like, you know. It's not really secret. It's just a private club. I mean, sure, maybe it is secret. It's not really. We know about it. The Masons. So this is the height of the tourist season in July. Like this is it in Hollywood. Like all these people are tourists. I mean, not all of them, but a lot of them. Because that's what you do is when you're in LA, is you come visit Hollywood Boulevard. So yeah. Say that again. Uh, I was walking here at 5 a.m. Oh, when we used to live over here? Yeah. It was completely empty. Oh, nobody. wow. So if you want to see it completely empty, just come at 5 in the morning. But um, we actually used to live over here um, in this place we call the Hell Hotel. And one day I might do a series of videos on our uh, hellish nomadic stories or like the bad experiences we had. I mean, moving from Seattle to LA, well it was Seattle, San Diego, then LA. It was just, we ran into so many negative situations, but one of the worst we stayed at a place here, it was like a, a guy had taken an office, Some, it turned out he was on drugs, like, anyway, 
and he was renting out of these offices as Airbnb units and he put like bunk beds in there and stuff like that. And like all these random people showed up and and it just it just went downhill. Like some crazy lady from New York came and like took over the place and turned out she was a witch and she was casting spells. It was just horrible. Like all these drug addicts and oh my god, it was just we had to get we literally had to like run out of there. Like I'm not kidding. It was horrible. So, but we were there for like a month and we got to really, like the play, the, the front door opens onto Hollywood Boulevard. So imagine your front door, you come out of your front door to this, like that's what it was like. And uh, yeah, it was crazy. So this is it. This is the main corner of Hollywood. This is like, you know, where all the action is. So it's Hollywood and Highlands. And this building that's always empty. I always wonder what's going on in that building. I don't even want to think about it. So that's where we were over there. That's where the mall is. The other thing about Hollywood is like, it's very expensive, like it's all tourists and everything is overpriced. It's like, and it's crowded and it's dirty and it's like, I don't know. It's worth seeing like once, really. But I don't like it, honestly. with a snake. <laughs> it's like a carnival here, man. If you like lots of crowds, come here. Nowhere to sit down. Can't go to the restroom. Give up all your money. Come here. I know, I'm being negative. Okay, y'all ready? They invited me to a screening that they're having in 10 minutes of Sunday. You want to go see the screening real quick? Not really. It's a TV show. You know? Not really. What kind of TV show? It's called Could Why Women Kill. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I'm looking at the topic of the enemy. That's why I come. Why I Women go. Kill? Yeah, I go to see. Oh, yeah, I want to see that. <laughs> what you see up to, you know? By the way, you can see lots of free uh, TV shows and movies. You could, they're, they're always handing out, like, uh, free passes and stuff. Let's go. He's a professional. 
Let's go. It's not easy, y'all. Hollywood, make some noise. Weighing at about 150 grams. This lady, she is single. With five baby mothers. Hey. He's been coming for ages. He got away. Let's go. The pod lock in mind. Whoa. Let's go. Whoa. Whoa, don't try to stay home, y'all. Watch this. That's not easy, everybody. Let's go. Whoa. This is how we got out of jail. I'm in jail. Let's go. Watch it. All right, that's it for Hollywood. We're at home, man. We're tired. See you later.